Church Tech Weekly presents NAB 2013, brought to you by Planning Center Resources. Never overbook again. All right, our continued uh, NAB 2013 coverage. We are here at the Yamaha booth in a like hermetically sealed box. And I'm here with uh, uh, Chris Hinson of uh, Yamaha, and he's going to talk about uh, their very, very new product in the continuing uh, line of products that is coming out this year. Just, just Yamaha's coming out with all kinds of new stuff. And uh, I, I just wanted you to talk a little bit about uh, the new Aj and uh, kind of what it is now and where it's going. Okay, my name is Chris Henson, of course, and this is a modular recording system uh, for the Nuendo platform from Steinberg. It's a collaboration between Yamaha and Steinberg to develop a highly interfaceable, uh, very uh, workflow efficient uh, work surface for the workstation environment. Uh, we've got fader units, we've got a main editor unit, and we can have as many as three devices, three fader units, and a controller unit. Uh, the system will function at frequency, sample frequencies from 44.1 up to 192 kilohertz. Uh, it is, can uh, process multiple file formats, wave file, broadcast wave, and wave 64, in addition to AIFF and all the standard file formats that you'd want to work in. It's compatible with Nuendo 6 and Cubase 7 and other platforms that you may want to work in. Uh, it's one of them. It's based on the Dante Audio Network, uh, so it's fully networkable and compatible with our CL series and Rio series uh, Dante mixing system. And uh, it's got a lot of unique features uh, like touch sensitive faders, touch sensitive knobs. It's got a, a lot of user definable key commands, and it has a unique feature called the touch slider, which allows us to slide channels across the linked units. And, um, and there's a lot of uh, workflow efficiencies built in. Uh, one of the things is that I am no longer uh, required to use the mouse for things like selecting files, uh, editing files, I can trim files, I can do fade ins and outs, and these are things that in the past have always had to be done with the mouse. Um, this is something for Yamaha that we're getting back into the recording and production business. Uh, the price point on the product is uh, $12,000 retail for a fader unit, $11,000 retail for the main controller unit. The PCI card for processing audio, network audio in the computer is $1,350. The I.O. units range from $2,800 to $3,300, and the Nuendo software retails for $2,295. Now, can it be used on a Mac or PC? It is cross-platform. And I, I see these really cool monitors up here are HP, um, but what Will any monitor work with the system, or do you guys recommend these monitors? Well, we recommend the HP monitor because they have the best viewing angle. So because this is uh, a fully expanded, a 10-foot-long console, if I'm at the far end, I can still see the audio channels on the monitor at the opposite end. With a lower-cost monitors, uh, your, your image really collapses, so you have to get directly in front of them to really see it. Um, some of the lesser monitors have like a 40-degree viewing angle, and these have something like a 150-degree viewing angle. And that makes a big difference when you're trying to manage lots of channels in multiple views. Cool. And now, when when is all this stuff shipping? Uh, we are slating our avail availability for the end of May 2013. Cool. And where can people go on to the Yamaha site and learn more about this? You can check out our site at uh, yamahaca.com or steinberg.net, and you will find information about both the hardware and software in both those locations. Cool. Thanks a lot, Chris. We appreciate it. 